second Kazuya Mishima in um, New York, and the, God, the person's tag is Dark Blues. Oh. Yeah, Dark Blues. The person's tag is Ski. But and he's got that nice crisp white suit. Oh, and 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 the Ski suit, some would call it. Oh my God. <laughs> oh no. You deserve everything that's happened to you for your tag. I'm sorry. What? Um, your tag, your your, 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 your in-game tag. I would not wish that back air on my worst enemy. I would. That was gross. I would wish it on someone who decides to. You deserve it. Oh, that. you know what? I'm being a little bit. You, yeah, I'm no, being a little bit. You don't need to hit the kid while he's down right now. Oh, same goes for Dill, by the way. Yeah, and <laughs> you don't need to keep doing this. Oh my, oh my. Ah! Uh, you're gonna uh, lose. You holy moly! It's worth noting, you Dill only has 15 seconds to make this a three stock in one minute. Come on. So, come on. Time's no. running out, Dill. No, okay, I'm not gonna get it. I don't think. All I don't right. know. I'm, he's, he's oh, out. we have. Come on, do it. Do it. I'm out for blood here. Oh! No! Oh, yeah! yeah! Record time, baby. One Yo, minute, three. One point minute, point three stops. A minute. Point they'll, zero they'll six. Still speed run. We're 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 we're, 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 we're shit posting a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> we're shit, this, this this that that set did not start off well, and I <sighs> and I, you know what? It, it, we're we're playing Super Smash Bros, folks. Believe it or not, that was in fact Super Smash Bros that we just saw. No. <laughs> um. Wow. One minute. Dill. Yeah, uh, I, okay, so... That was kind of a waxing. Like, that, yes. Terry! At the same time. Okay. Oh, okay. Mm, okay. Better so matchup. I, I I do agree that this is a better matchup. Uh, but let's let's see how it's going to go. Um, funnily enough, Dill actually did already play a Terry to make it here. Um, G-Money. Uh, we're going to see, though, if Skeet can make some adaptations here. Um, and already looking off to a much better start, getting a quick 57 on to Jill. A little bit of a percent lead thus far for uh, Skeet. And, you know, already putting Jill into disadvantage. So yes. They were looking much better. That Kazuya game was actually just a mental play around trying to lull Dill into a false sense of security. Uh, because actually, this game is looking pretty good for Skeet. Skeet's looking pretty nice. Mm. All right, um, Dill Howard though, uh, beginning to maintain that that stage control. Oh, uh, nice use of the burning knuckle there. Ooh. Going for a little bit of a read right there, then end up working out. All right, now we actually have this sort of situation where, wow, finds the kill with that jab, jab, umpy. And after a one minute game, a stock lead one minute into this game for Ski. Yeah, credit turnaround, and now it is in fact go time. 100%, 37, boom, 54. Man, Terry's moves are just so, are you dead here? Oh, <gasps> Oh, you're dead! You're dead. Uh, this is the, the turnaround from Skeet is 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 truly so, something crazy. And you're already taking 31. Okay, crack shoot twice. <gasps> okay, I honestly, if you manage to get a two a three stock in two minutes, also commendable. Yeah. Okay, Padilla off the stage here. This is gonna be tough. Oh wow, great low recovery Ooh. right there. Yeah, this. And that lower recovery okay, was so okay, important. Yeah, that should be you, you died. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, that lower recovery was so important because it also maintained the go. Yeah. Uh, killing, <laughs> yes, killing Skeet right now. I think this oh, is a sort of situation. Dill wants to be ending his life early. Yeah. No, Skeet. I mean, you kind of have to hear. Um, and, and almost a quick zero to death right there. Uh, with the with the Rob Jar stuff. Dill does not have the strongest of those uh, confirms when it comes to raw players in general. Um, you know, Dill's strength really comes from her neutral. Mm -hmm. um, however, gonna need something real big here. Already that 129% mark. Yeah, the neutral and also another part to Dill's uh, game plan that's really good is like the, the stage positioning advantage. But in this game in particular, Skeet has just been recovering for free, getting off ledge really easily, just bypassing what's normally one of Dill's best suits as a player. Oh, and read the spot dodge? After the parry? Okay. I mean, okay, it makes sense because I feel like there was no guaranteed punish. Yo, yeah, after that, after that parry, it's Rob so. Nair. So, um, you know, and Rob, it was Rob Nair from far away. So I don't think the down smash would have been fast enough. But yeah, a, a spot dodge. Actually, Rob was pretty close there. But um, yeah. I think that was yeah, that was just charged up the down smash. I think was expecting either a spot dodge or a roll. Uh, but and that was such a good that trade worked out so well. Actually, hold on a second. Can we go back to that last clip just for a moment? Um, here, if if Dill had not up aired? No, did jump. Uh, Dil no, no, Dil if Dil had not up aired, would he, would he have died? Uh, she. No. 
Oh no, he had his jump. Okay, okay, gotcha. He had his jump. Okay. I was I was actually thinking if it was like some no. really Giga no. Galaxy Brain stuff, if he only went down there knowing that the trade of the upper would keep him alive. Yeah. No. Um so that was quite the turnaround from game number one. <laughs> yeah. Uh goodness gracious. Uh so Skeet, after making some strong reads, getting two quick stocks. Gonna have to maintain that momentum going into game two. We are going to Battlefield. The stage that is a little bit more difficult to get in on Rob. Those platforms are get a little bit more difficult yeah. for Terry to get in. Not only that, but when it comes to landing, it's gonna be a lot easier for Dill. You saw that Dill was having trouble trying to no. go in between those two platforms. This time doesn't necessarily have to deal with that. But Dill was kind of uh, yeah, just hanging out in the corner. And what a catch on that shield drop. 79%. Oh, my Damn. God. Oh. We are lucky that Battlefield has a big ceiling because Dill very well could have died there on many other stages. Yeah. Oh, but as things stand, 100, 104%. Wow. The damage is growing. But, you know, because actually Skeet is not at 100 yet, doesn't quite have the same kill power that uh, normally we think of Terry having. Okay, but quick touches here from Dill. Oh, then they're not quite catching the roll in, and that's so big. Dill's touches game is really, really strong. Missing that is pretty huge. Actually got the neutral air, but was not really expecting it, so didn't get any kind of follow up. And now 120. This is going to be a really difficult wow. entry. Oh, there and it the, is. The, the, the tracking there was immaculate. You saw Dill wait so perfectly on time for the burning knuckle, and it ended up allowing Dill to get that stock, which is huge. However, that's going to be a trade right there for the gyro. And Terry doesn't care about trades, so he's going right through it, and going to be able to take that stock. Yeah, okay, once more, though, put at the ledge. Are you dead? Might be. Terry doesn't have a whole lot of ways to get back, but wow, an excellent use of the power oh! but we got caught under the stage of Battlefield. The little lip at the bottom of the stage takes Terry's stock, takes Geet's second stock, and is now that's, in an awful position. Yeah, that's absolutely heartbreaking because now this is a deal with a massive lead. And Dill is hard enough to deal with already. When you give her something like an entire stock, extra stock to work with, oh, it just, just goes out of control. And you're going to need to get an early stock here. You're already 55%. You know, the motivation definitely has to be a factor here. You know, the, you're down two stocks. You lost a stock to something that was kind of a little wacky. This is going to be difficult for Skeet here. Ooh. Okay. Looking for one of these really powerful go moves. That might be a bit of an equalizer, but there's so much distance that needs to be made up. This might be it. Gets the up air, but Battlefield keeping him alive. But Skeet, oh, the sour, sour spot. spot that going to be surviving, but for how yeah. long? Not Can, long at all. Cannot get up. We've seen a lot of people just, you know, not super thinking the right options versus Dill's gyro ledge. Yeah, just know that you, you can never neutral get up. Never, ever neutral get up as Rob. If Rob has a gyro. Ever, ever, ever. Um, some characters can get up attack. Some characters can jump. But you just want to do jump air dodge most of the time. That's what's going to get what's going to get that there. So, unfortunately, for Ski, after an excellent game, too, not going to be able to take it. Dill's going to be moving on. Yeah, that, that getting caught underneath Battlefield was just such yeah, a... It was rough. Such a run-ender. But uh, anyway, good stuff to Dill. Going to be moving on in the winner side of things, uh, guaranteeing herself a spot in winner's semis. Yep. So, guaranteed fifth. So, we have Vivi, LRA... No, King Arc one, right? Yeah, King Arc yes, one, that's King that. Arc. So, uh, we have Vivi, King Arc, um, Dill John Numbers, and Dill moving on further into this bracket. I'm not sure if that's the exact order that they're going to play against each other in. But, uh, yeah, so make sure you stay tuned for that, folks. Um, we have been Muno and Salty Clown. I think Salty Clown's going to stay on for you. I'm probably going to head off. So please have an excellent night, folks, if you would like to. I'm actually private right now because I'm a teacher and I can't have my students following my account. Um, oh, yeah, so sad. I, are you kidding me? What I don't if want just, seventh what if graders just... following my Twitter. Um, Why don't you just come up with, like, a second Twitter that's, like, no seventh graders allowed in the in the app so that they can't follow you? <sighs> Well, what if you just changed your tag to something that all seventh graders hate? Just like definitely boomer not humor. me. At boomer humor. If you're asking, yeah. <laughs> I'm Munoz, not Munel. Okay. <laughs> um, with that said, uh, enjoy your night, folks. Have a good one. Follow Salty Fun as well, um, and we'll see you around. Okay. Bye, y'all.